Okay, the 2017 National Rifle Association annual meeting was held this year in Atlanta, Georgia. And like I try to do at these shows, I, I kind of wanted to showcase some smaller, maybe lesser known brands. We're going to take a look at one of those next coming up here on Survival on Purpose. Welcome back to Survival on Purpose coverage of the 2017 NRA convention. I'm here with Todd Cole from Recluse Holsters. And Todd's come up with some really innovative pocket holsters, including a, one design that is patented. So Todd, first of all, thanks for taking time to talk to Absolutely. us. I always like to showcase small businesses because I'm one myself. So um, tell us a little bit about your company, how you got started, and what you got what, what you got here as far as holsters go. Okay. Well, started very simply needing a holster that I could draw from without any extra movement. I've been in an armed robbery where I kind of experienced the experience of that. And I thought, boy, if someone says to you, oh, give me your wallet, I just want to be able to reach my pocket and pull out my gun. And when I looked at the time, it was, I watched you know, YouTube video, and this guy was like, put your hand in, cock back, put your left hand over. And I thought, man, you can't do that. Yeah. So because of my construction background and other things, I always learned, you know, sometimes it's best, better to start with a clean sheet of paper. And so I literally started with a piece of cardboard and some exercise mat, and I came up with the one-sided holster. So the outside is a full coverage, so it doesn't print through. Then on the inside, you have a little muzzle pouch and then the trigger block that is designed for every individual one. But you come in, snaps in, holds it in place. Your pocket's part of the holster. So when it goes in, you're encasing that one-sided holster. There's so no danger of the trigger being pulled accidentally. It's completely enclosed. Well, it's enclosed on three sides, and because it's enclosed muzzle, you go down and into the side. So there's no movement forward on that, and so it's in your pocket. It's very simple, and your draw out is very natural. And that that's patented, right? Yes, I got a pat. It's patented one-sided holster. There you go. Pretty cool. Really heavy on names there. <laughs> Keep it simple. Yeah. Uh, and so, yeah, when I shared with a friend this uh, idea, he had said, well, I've been carrying my little 32 in my pocket loose for seven years because I've never found anything. And I thought, well, here, let me give you one. Tell me what you think. He wore it for a week, brought it back, and he says, you aren't getting it back because I like it. So I thought, well, maybe I have something here. The start of a great idea. Yeah, so that was when I lived in Nashville. Since then, I moved up to Washington State, little gig harbor up there it's nice to be back on the water where i got a big picture window view to work from uh, of the water uh some great people of course we've expanded now uh there's some other styles uh we have keeping it simple the two-sided holster so leather on both sides with the clamshell design so when you stick your fingers in it spreads and can draw out but you still get that full coverage on the outside so if you got a glock or an xd or something with a toggle trigger then you don't have to have exactly to check that. yes and it's folded, molded all the way over the 938s the glocks xds uh, so many more yeah cool. uh, and a lot of people just like that approach once you realize hey in my pocket i'm going from the top it's okay to have the side covered so you still make these yourself so I, my hands are on every holster. Uh, I basically cut every holster. I uh, put all the trigger blocks on. I polish a lot of them. I have a couple of people helping me too, though. But yeah, yeah very small. Yeah, it's very out of my good. house. Okay, so so what's the, the retail on these holsters? Uh, Fifty nine ninety five is the retail for, and I make them out of steer hide and horse hide. So uh, the horse hide's a little bit more around seventy seven dollars, but I just really like the way horse hide works, and it repels moisture and sweat and such. So what would somebody do? How would somebody get one of your holsters? Uh, pretty much recluseholster.com online, and there's a full list of all the manufacturers, and then a handguns, pictures of all of them. So when you go in, you're going to your specific gun, you're seeing exactly what's available just for yours. Very cool. And pictures to see it, and the options. You know, everything has the options for the lasers. There's more than 1,500 variations wow. right now, so that's pretty much every holster is made to order. So it's being made for you. They are hand molded, they're hand stitched. So it's a nice saddle stitch that'll last forever. So, I mean, I think that's a really good price for a handmade custom holster uh, for 60 bucks, 70 bucks. So, Todd, thanks so much for taking yeah, time for talking to you. us. Thank you for watching Survival on Purpose. I put out a new video every Friday and every Saturday and occasionally a random video throughout the week. You can watch another one right over here. And if you're not subscribed, you can fix that by clicking right down here. Once again, my name is Brian. Remember, survival's not an accident, so be prepared. I'll see you next time.